Hi guys, it's Barbara with Quartz Rose Tarot. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I upload new content. Guys, I'm going to be giving away three free three question readings the whole month of December. So if you're interested in getting one of those readings, leave me a comment that you're interested in. If I comment under your comment that you have won, then you're the winner. So with that, let's get into Gemini. Gemini, you were dealing with somebody who was dealing with somebody else and you had enough and you said, I'm done, I'm out peace. And the minute you walked out that door and you were done, this person is beside themselves trying to get rid of that third party to come back to you. Because I mean, I feel like that was really all it took was you standing your ground. But it was a long term lesson here. That's what I'm seeing. So stick around. Let's see where this goes. Gemini, let's get into your energy, then we'll get into the energy of all 12 signs. Then we'll get into your spread, and then I'll get you some clarity. So with that, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits, and Guides, clarity and guidance for Gemini, please. Gemini, somebody is juggling a family situation, juggling a, yeah, juggling a family situation. So let's get into your energy and see what's going on. You're dealing with an Aries. Someone's getting some clarity. They see something clearly and they want to offer their love. So they're, they've gone within. I feel like they this person wants to be with you. You're dealing with a Taurus. There's a tower moment because somebody's needing strength. If you're dealing with another Gemini, there's passionate communication to the Empress. If you're dealing with a Cancer, you have the King of Cups with secrets. Could be illusion secrets. Mastering his emotions. Uh, mastering his emotions with the the um, the moon. The moon is something that uh, could be strong emotions. Trying to get his strong emotions under control could be secrets, could be illusions, it could be strong emotions. So let's see what's going on with Leo. Leo wants to heal from a third party situation, or they want to heal and reconcile. If you're dealing with a Virgo, there's a harsh truth about some deception. If you're dealing with a Libra, I feel like somebody's daydreaming about their emperor, their emperor. And if you're dealing with a, if you're dealing with a Scorpio, there's a missed opportunity with their soulmate. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, somebody seeing something clearly from a different perspective, and they may have some regrets. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, someone's trying to reconcile and have a new beginning of love and abundance. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, Aquarius may be making a decision to cut something out and block somebody. If you're dealing with a Pisces, there could be an apology. Someone's going to be successful at either an offer or an apology. So let's get into your reading and find out what's going on for Gemini. So somebody is juggling a family situation. They're making a decision here. Or this could be a making a decision. It also could be a, a juggling. Okay, so. Okay, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Gemini. Okay, so there's a family betrayal here. So somebody was juggling a family situation is your energy. There was a family situation where somebody was betrayed and they're not speaking. They're using their intuition. Um, that's causing a tower moment. There's a new beginning in love. I'm going to come back to this seven of cups because this could be with an option or this could be daydreaming. So let's see. We have a Queen of Wands here showing up. Queen of Wands is someone who's interfering in a situation. This person is left out in the cold. Somebody is taking a leap of faith to to balance out a situation, to be patient for a long time. This is going... Something that you've been going through for a long time, Gemini, is going to end so something new can begin. But taking that leap of faith to balance something out. 
for a long time, you've been trying to balance something out to end it so something new can begin. So there is some some kind of a cycle closing for you as well. A harsh truth being spoken. Somebody, you have two nights and, and, and you have a two choices. So I feel like a harsh truth being spoken and somebody wanting to be with you, but there was a choice between two. There was a choice. And this person regrets it. And they're looking back at the past mistakes that were made. And they, they're, they're trying to communicate emotional. They're coming in very immature, though, okay? Under the bottom of the deck because you're the empress here. Let me get a drink real quick. Okay, let's see what's going on, Gemini. Why is the Ten of Cups here for Gemini? So someone's at a crossroads about a family situation. There was betrayal and a lot of drama. A lot of strife, a lot of jealousy, a lot of competition. Um, betrayal. Someone's not speaking to the pre-empress. And it's causing a tower moment in something long-term and committed. New love. Someone's heartbroken about new love. With an option moving on. So... I feel like for this Gemini, this Gemini is leaving a situation. This could be someone's leaving you or you're leaving a family situation. You're at a crossroads about this family situation and you're tired of the betrayal and the drama. And I feel like this is you. I feel like this is you. You're not speaking. I don't feel like this is they're not speaking to you. I feel like this is your energy. You've had enough of some kind of drama in a family situation and you're no longer speaking to somebody. and. It's causing a tower moment because something was long-term and committed, right? But there's somebody heartbroken because you're going towards new love. And I feel like there is an option to move on here. You have options. This could be you. This could be your person. Take it out. Resonates with you. There's a queen of wands here. That's toxic. Somebody who is just a piece of work, okay? This person right here is a piece of work. Causes a lot of drama in a situation. This person interferes. This is the mistress of the deck. Okay, she's also the sorceress of the deck. Um, but she's very toxic with her wand in her hand. So she could be a witch. Just saying. Um, something that's very toxic about her. Someone's being left out in the cold. The option's being left out in the cold. Okay, so look at this. Look at this. <laughs> You've had enough of something and you're saying, I'm out of here. I'm done. I'm over this nonsense. You can have her. I don't want her. That kind of thing. Or you can have whatever this is. You can have that. I'm going to go find what's important to me. I'm going to go get new love. I'm like, I'm tired of being heartbroken over this person. So I'm moving on to my own options. I have options and I'm moving on. Um, but this other person, this person that you're walking away from and you're, you said, I'm over it. They're saying, oh, no, um, I'm kicking her to the curb and it's time for us to get, you know, they want to take that leap of faith out of the cold. They want to come out of the cold with you. Right. They want to find some kind of a balance to work on a situation. For a long time, they've been watching. They've got their eye on you. They know that you're over it. I, I feel like they didn't believe you in the past. They were getting away with whatever they were doing and you were. um trying to battle it but uh, there comes a point where you go no I'm 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 not going to fight for this anymore I'm not I'm not uh, you know there's an ending of a cycle and that so the healing can begin okay so this person that's causing so much drama in your relationship is no longer going to be in the relationship whether it's married or not um this is your 10 of cups 10 of pentacles so I feel like this is your true match being a pre-empress this could be your emperor that you're dealing with as far as that goes so Look, they're closing out a cycle. They're ending something to start something new so healing can begin. And I feel like with this, you know, this is, you were patient. I feel like this could be two things, that they're they're trying to be patient to work on a situation or they were you were patient where this third party situation was. And I feel like you've had enough though. They want to come out of the cold. There's a harsh truth. This person wants to be with you. And, and I feel like this is because you're their soulmate. But there was deception. And the victory caused a tower moment 
but it is now ended. So with clarity, right? Okay. So whatever this is, you're their soulmate and they want to be with you. And there's a harsh truth being spoken here. Once you said that harsh truth, this is you're speaking the harsh truth. I'm out of here. I don't deal with this anymore. Then this person's old, like the knight in shining armor is coming in, right? Because you're their soulmate. They know they are, but there was deception. And somebody's ego was getting in the way, right? And it's caused the tower moment. That ego, this isn't about a win. This is not about a, the deception winning. No, this is about this person's ego, wanting to be seen head and shoulders above the rest. Lying, cheating, stealing, wanting to be seen as the best, right? Their ego, and it caused the tower moment. That tower fell for that person because, look, when you walked out the door, they lost everything. They lost it all, right? So they've decided to end whatever they were doing because they've gotten the clarity they need. All you needed to do, Jim and I, was shut that door and walk away for them to realize they done effed up. So regretting the past, regretting what they've done, there's emotional communication. Uh, they need the strength, right, to communicate. Uh, this is like, I'm sorry. You know, I'm sorry. You are my wish fulfillment. And I may have blocked, I may have blocked my queen of pentacles. Um, I may have blocked you, you know. Um, this is the empress in, in the minor arcana, right? Passionate communication that they want to be with you. They want to rush towards you. They're being strategic. Or this could be your energy. You're, you know, even though you're, you're an empress, you're coming in as the king of swords. You're like, mm, not today, Satan, not today. Um, you're being strategic. You're waiting. You're waiting for a decision. Someone's mastering their emotions. You may be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. It has to do with betraying of a relationship, but they've now walked away in divine timing. For a long time, the truth needed to be spoken, right, to find this happiness or been brought to. This also could have been, it took a long time for this harsh truth to be illuminated. That's what I feel like. Uh, I feel like the harsh truth, divine timing is, it took a long time for this harsh truth to be illuminated. For them to walk away from, because they betrayed you and walked away from this relationship. But this person, mastering their emotions, you may be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Wow, Gemini. All you had to do was close the door. And just not look back. And then this person's going to see your value. Right? They're finding what they manifested. They're finding the beauty they manifested. Right? The beauty is you. Right? Prosperity. Things will happen for both of you, I feel like. But this person needed willpower. I feel like willpower was at play for this person. Or this person had no willpower. They needed to find that. Right? Their happiness. To find their happiness with empowerment. So this person had to take control. Emperor energy had to take control of a situation. Had to take control of the situation. Say no. <laughs> Say no. <laughs> Burst out of your cocoon. I feel like this is you expressing your joy. You said no. You said I'm out. I'm not I'm done. I'm not playing. Uh say no. Burst out your cocoon. Bust out of your cocoon and express your joy. And I was like, yeah, I'm free. That's what you're like. I'm done. I'm over it. I'm out. Okay. And nurturing yourself first is what's under under the deck. So good for you, Gemini, standing in that power. Trusting in divine timing. Trusting in the divine plan. I feel like you you just you just gave it up and walked out and like when you listen to what you're being told to do by your guides, I feel like it's going to fall in place because it's very hard to walk away and let go when it's a twin. It's a very hard situation. This is somebody you cannot get out of your head. They cannot get you out of their head either. But that fresh start, third party, divine timing, inner child, Unhappy about an offer. Look, family and fifth dimension was a lesson for this new direction, right? In order to get this person, you were giving this person, when you walked out the door, a fresh start with a third party. They're like, oh, you got it. You can have it, right? 
divine timing stepped in divine timing is at play here but you knew that your inner child knew that this was meant to be when the way it was meant to be right i feel like you're getting your money right but grief of an offer someone has grief with this offer or someone's apologizing for the grief i feel like you gave this person a fresh start with a third party you're like mm, i'm done i'm out you go ahead and keep that you keep that i'll be over here but that was a toxic relationship and i feel like this person um you're i feel like you're working on your money in this case but grief of an offer there's grief of an offer family situation fifth dimension so i feel like this is your family in the fifth dimension is around you guiding you through all of this it had to happen this way it had to happen this way because it was a lesson this person wasn't going to learn the lesson until you were completely done and they knew it so the fear of losing you is what brought this person back okay the fear of losing you brought them back to a new direction i feel like that's what's happening i feel like your family may be involved here they may this may be your family in the fifth dimension but i feel like this also could be your family here and this fifth dimension is the twin flame that this is but there's grief with this offer so when you when you shut that door this person did not know what to do with themselves I feel like that's what's happening here. So, Gemini, that's all I have for you. I think I'm going to take this to the extended and get you some more clarity. So if it resonates, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you over in Vimeo for the extended.